But it says in the literature that we become productive members of society. You know what it is that back then, and I'm introducing, we couldn't make meetings like this because the police used to come, right? And arrest us. Yeah, there were some places like New York. You was on parole and I was on parole. We were going to get locked up. You know what I'm saying? But we're fortunate now, man, that this program has proven itself in man's entire history. That if you do dope, you should be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? So let me introduce my man, Dre. Dre, Dre in the house. Give it up, give it up for yourselves. DJ, no tracks. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, DJ? How everybody doing? How's the chicken? It's good. I'm black, I had to ask that. The white guy's looking at me like, how does he not know? <laughs> Give it up for me, I just had a baby. Uh, yeah, all right, yeah. First baby. I'm happy as hell for that. I get the family to do dumb shit that parents get to do all the time. You be like, hey, lady, how's, how old is that beautiful baby? They be like, 468 months. Fuck, I gotta be mad now? Jesus Christ. My baby three months years old. Yeah, three months years old. I get to say that. I don't know how to say my baby three months. It's just, it don't sound right, do it? My baby three months years old. She's gorgeous. I don't like that my girlfriend, she do baby talks with her. She like, Andre, you know what that means? That means go downstairs and get a bottle. I'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> she ain't mind my business. She didn't say that. That means you gotta go to the store and get some diapers. What? So one time, I, I, I baby talked to her. I'm like, you know what the fuck that meant? She making me a little head later on so I won't be grouchy. You understand, right? Jesus Christ. How's everybody doing, man? Give it up for yourselves. Talk about my comics. One, 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 Raul. We, we, fuck, we never knew you was on that shit, Raul. <laughs> I'm learning a lot tonight. <laughs> Where Miz at? Miz took a muscle. Yeah, I'm clean. I'm on drugs. Miz, you only do weed. For real. The fuck? Chill. Miz had me on a roller coaster. I was emotional. Laughing. <laughs> martial arts in the UFC, I learned up with a little new, maybe because I got put in it one night. It's called the cookie tornado hole. When you fall asleep with anything, you put it off. <sighs> one day I got put in it. My girlfriend was like, eat the coochie, Dre. I'm like, girl, I cannot breathe. I have asthma. She like, eat the coochie, Dre. I'm like, I am going to die if you do not get me out this hole. I am turning blue. She like, eat the coochie, Dre. I said, all right. Blah, 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 blah. That's my baby mother. <laughs> We're gonna get married. She has drive. <laughs> she does. It's a lot of beautiful women in here. There's only six of y'all. <laughs> one of y'all don't count. I don't. That's somebody. I, you know, everybody got that one. I, she don't count. She got a big ass butt, but that's Craig guy. We can't. We can't have sex with her. I don't like pretty women. Why? There's too much to do. Just like Miss does. You gotta go to the store and get tampons and know what the wings do when you got a pretty girlfriend. You got an ugly girlfriend, you can fuck around a jabber. Play fight, baby, but you hit a rough and hard. He's laughing, he had ugly girlfriends. He's like, remember, remember, remember? I loved her. I will drop her. Ugly girlfriends. I had a girl so ugly when uh, her feet was ugly. She could pick up shit, but her feet, shit. Ooh, Starburst. Oh, watermelon. <laughs> I mean, I, 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 something about ugly girls. Like, we all go, ah, people be like, beauty is an eye, beholder. I don't care if you're beautiful or ugly or whatever. No, that's, that's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. Because if two pretty girls come out there outside fight right now, somebody's going to get baby oil thrown on them, and we're going to have a mud wrestling match. <laughs> If two ugly girls go out there and fight, we're going to get rocks and blades and we're going to throw it in and see who kills each other. Only one survives, ugly. <laughs> who 
who's ugliest? You decide. <laughs> Kill her. <laughs> but if it was an ugly girl versus a pretty girl, we would stop that shit in a heartbeat. People would turn to Martin Luther King, a white guy, Buck Bill, who would turn to Martin Luther King like, Shannon, Shannon now, Shannon with your ugly ass, get away from pretty ass Rakesha. Get away from Rakesha. If you lay a hand, good God almighty, if you lay a hand, kick your ass. I like the echo effect, make me feel epic. <laughs> I'm like, yo, <laughs> I know we're not supposed to be talking about drugs, but I think I am high. <laughs> we are sober 